So we've done lots since the Blueprint launch. Um, we are in full-on planning and execution mode to mobilise ourselves for delivery in um, phase one in 2020. We've done some quick wins already that you might have seen. So we've got Munich Re up and running in a syndicate in a box. Um, and we've also launched a new syndicate with AIG that's using those syndicate in a box new streamlined rules. Um, we've also got our governance established. Um, we've been to Seaboard and Council um, and talked them through our progress and our planning. We've also been continuing our engagement with the market through our advisory committees and also the design labs themselves have been doing lots of market engagement to work through their plans and look at what they need in terms of resources, market input um, and maybe some help from external parties too. So what happens next in um, early 2020, we're planning in February to do a Blueprint 1A. So that will tell everybody what we've been doing in this transition phase and what to expect in 2020. Um, we want to plan in some more quick wins as well because it's really important that we show that progress. And we want to be increasingly transparent about what we're doing. So we'll be launching things like a blogging platform and where we're creating some code, you'll start to see some of those elements coming out too. Um, the teams obviously will be carrying on their planning um, and very importantly they're working on what the next set of pilots and proof of concepts will be. So that'll be how we start to frame up some of those new solutions, the things that we want to test with users and where we want to really get the market involved. So I'm excited to see what some of those things look like. So beyond the actual pilots and proof of concepts themselves and how we develop the new solutions, it's all about how we work. Um, and how our people will get to work in different ways. So, you know, we've really looked at how some of the best digital transformations are delivered and they're delivered in quite a different way. So apart from our very strong user focus and market focus, we'll also be using techniques like service design for the first time. Um, we'll be using very agile ways of working so that we can change and adapt as we see how the solutions land with our users. Uh, so I think for the teams that will make them much more empowered to determine how we build some of these things, how we prioritise some of the functionality and give them lots of opportunity to test and to learn as we start to build the new world. Our people are vital to building the future, it's really, really important. So apart from the fact that we've got a number of our people obviously already involved, um, we will be starting to do some more resourcing of the lab. So you'll start to see some of the key leadership roles come out and we fully expect them to be staffed from a mixture of our people, from the market and maybe some external people as well. Um, and then as the labs start to build up their teams, there'll be more opportunities. And as we did previously during the Blueprint development, we want to be very open again. So you'll see lots of show and tells, you'll see lots of blogs from people, you might see some more videos like this from people. So you can really start to see what's going on in the labs and get involved as much as possible. I also recognise that people might have some unanswered questions. I mean, I do, we all do at this point in time. It's kind of where we're at in terms of the development. So that's fine um, and I think we'll start to address those questions as we move along and really I'm always happy to hear people's questions because they're things that we'll need to address or maybe we can answer them now. So talk to any of the team, talk to me, talk to your line manager, feed those questions through and we'll try and uh, answer those as much as we can as we go through the process of moving from transition into delivery. To sum up, I'd just like to say a big thank you to everybody for all their efforts and all their interest and all their input so far and the continued efforts that are going on in the labs and the work streams. I know we're in transition phase now but there's lots of work going on in transition and we're soon to get into the really good fun in delivery so I want everybody to keep their involvement and keep their energy high and keep their interest and we'll keep people updated and let them know what's happening as everything moves along.